what's up guys in this video i will show you how to download and install the google chrome browser on your own tv box now over here i have the on 4k google tv streaming device but it doesn't matter the type of on tv box you have whether you have the on android tv box or the on google tv 4k pro streaming box Following the same steps, you should be able to download and install the Google Chrome browser on any on TV box you have. Now to do this, first things first, you have to make sure that your on TV box is actually connected to the internet. And once that is done, the next thing you want to do is to go ahead and open up the Google Play Store or App Store of your on TV box. So basically, from the home of your device, you want to come over to the app section, usually at the top right corner of your on TV box. From here, you want to go ahead and open up the Google Play Store app or if you're using the on TV box with google tv just like this one then you just want to scroll over to this search in page feed over here now select it now from the google play store you want to go ahead and search for the app known as downloader it's a very popular app and we're going to be using this app to download the google chrome browser into our on tv box once you're done scroll down and click on the search icon over here now this will automatically search the google play store and give us results for downloader on our own tv box you can literally see the downloader app over here by AFTV news so i'll go ahead and select it just like so and then install it into my own tv box once it is downloaded and installed the next thing you want to do is to go ahead and open it up directly from here click on ok and then you want to head over to the browser tab at the top left corner of your downloader app on your own tv box so just scroll over to the left hand side come over to this browser tab and then select it now scroll over to the input field at the top and then you want to go ahead and clear up everything inside of this input field then type the following url you want to go ahead and type bit dot lie forward slash c c c c c in five places then tv so go ahead and type the following url bit.live forward slash cccc in five places then tv once you're done typing go ahead and click on the enter button over here and then click on go now this will automatically redirect you to the google chrome browser page where you can actually download the google chrome browser into your own tv box now at this point you just want to continuously scroll down until you get to the download button over here so just go ahead and click on download google chrome apk i'll give the tv some few minutes to fully download and install the google chrome browser and once the installation process is completed the next thing you want to do is to go ahead and click on the install button and the google chrome browser apk will start installing into your own tv box with google tv now at this point you want to go ahead and give your downloader app permission to install apps from unknown sources into your own tv box so just go ahead and click on the settings button over here and then just toggle on this permission for the downloader app then go back to the downloader app and then click on the install button now now you can just click on the install button over here so i'll just go ahead and click on the open button to open up the google chrome browser on my own tv box and as you can see we now have the google chrome browser running smoothly on our own tv box now one thing you have to note at this particular point is the fact that because this google chrome browser is not natively built to run on tvs or streaming devices just like this one you may not be able to control the google chrome browser using your own tv box remote control for you to be able to properly and comfortably navigate through all of the options on your google chrome browser you have to connect a keyboard to your own tv box now this can actually be a bluetooth keyboard a wired keyboard or just any keyboard at all once it is connected to your own tv box you should be able to navigate through all of the options over here without any issue if you find this video useful please make sure you smash the like button and subscribe to this youtube channel for more interesting tech tips like this one